Magnetic Compass Adjuster Course Magnetic Compass Adjuster Course delves in magnetism theory and offers hands-on techniques for precise compass adjustment. Participants learn about magnetism, deviation, variation, parts of a compass and techniques of adjusting compasses to ensure accurate navigation at sea, crucial for safe vessel operations. Course Overview 1. Comprehensive Program this program will cover the basics of compass adjustment, including the theory behind it and the practical steps you need to take to correctly adjust a magnetic compass. 2. Target Audience The Magnetic Compass Adjuster course is ideal for maritime professionals, including ship captains, navigators and service engineers who are looking to enhance their skills and knowledge in compass adjustment and maintenance. 3. Accreditations for the marine and offshore industry, as per publicly available guidelines. Principle of Compass Adjustment with Earth's Magnetic Field Earth's Magnetic Field The Earth's magnetic field acts like a giant bar magnet, with the north and south magnetic pole. A compass needle aligns itself with this field, pointing towards magnetic north and south. Ship's Magnetic Signature A ship's metal parts create a magnetic field that interacts with the Earth's field. This interaction causes the compass to deviate from true north, resulting in errors. Compass Adjustment Process Compass adjustment aims to compensate for the ship's magnetic signature. This is achieved by using corrector magnets to counteract the ship's magnetic field, bringing the compass needle closer to true north. Ship's Magnetism as a Signature A ship's magnetic signature is determined by its shape, materials, and construction and is influenced by factors such as hull size and shape, machinery layout, and materials used. Compass Design General Principles Compass Card The compass card contains the magnetic north, marked as 0 degrees, and degrees are marked in increments of 5 degrees, with the cardinal directions north, south, east, and west being labeled. The card rotates freely within the compass housing, Compass Needle The compass needle is made of a magnetic material that aligns itself with the Earth's magnetic field. The needle is attached to the compass card and rotates with it. Compass Housing The compass housing protects the compass card and needle and provides a stable platform for the compass. It is typically made of a non-magnetic material, such as brass, to avoid interfering with the compass needle's alignment. Damping Mechanism The damping mechanism helps to reduce the compass card's oscillations and allows it to settle quickly after being disturbed. This is achieved by using a fluid, such as alcohol or kerosene, that creates a resistance to the card's movement. Magnetic Compass Errors and Compensation Deviation Deviation is the compass error caused by the ship's own magnetic field. This error varies depending on the ship's heading and can be significant especially in steel ships. Variation Variation is the error caused by the Earth's magnetic field, which changes based on location. This error is constant for a given location and is known as the magnetic variation. Quadrantal error Quadrantal error is caused by the ship's magnetic field interacting with the compass card. It can be corrected using compensating magnets. Healing error This error occurs when the ship is healed or tilted causing the compass card to tilt. It can be corrected using compensating magnets. Magnetic Compass Adjustment Procedures Preparation Ensure a clean workspace, gather tools and materials, and consult relevant manuals. Initial Observations Observe the compass's initial behavior and record any existing errors or deviations. Corrections and Adjustments Make precise adjustments using correctors, such as magnets or flinders bars, to eliminate deviations. Verification. Verify the accuracy of the compass by comparing its readings with known reference points. Documentation. Document all adjustments made, including the types of correctors used and their positions. This process requires meticulous attention to detail and a thorough understanding of magnetic principles. The goal is 
to achieve a compass that is free from significant deviations, providing accurate heading information for safe navigation. Safety considerations in compass adjustment. Equipment safety. Inspect and maintain the compass and adjustment equipment regularly. Ensure all components are in good working order before starting the adjustment process. If there are any issues, repair them before proceeding. Environmental considerations. Compass adjustment can involve working with magnetic materials. Be mindful of the impact on surrounding equipment and instruments. Take precautions to avoid interference with other sensitive equipment. Documentation and record keeping. Maintain accurate records of compass adjustments, including any corrective actions taken. This documentation will help you track the performance of the compass and identify any trends or issues. Safe distances of navigational and other equipment from compass. Wheelhouse. The wheelhouse should be located away from magnetic interference sources like powerful electric motors or large metal objects. Radio equipment. Radio antennas, especially high-power transmitters, can generate magnetic fields that can affect the compass. Engine room. The engine room contains large electrical components like generators and motors which can create significant magnetic interference. Radar. Radar equipment, especially high-power radar systems, can produce magnetic fields that can impact the compass readings. Compass liquid composition and characteristics. Composition. Compass liquid is typically a mixture of distilled water, alcohol, and a dye. The alcohol acts as an antifreeze, preventing the liquid from freezing in cold climates. The dye is used to make the liquid visible and easier to read. Characteristics. The liquid must be non-corrosive to the compass components and have a low viscosity, so it flows easily and doesn't impede the movement of the compass needle. The liquid also needs to have a low vapor pressure, so it doesn't evaporate too quickly. Purpose. The compass liquid serves several purposes. It dampens the oscillations of the compass needle making it easier to read. It also helps to protect the compass needle from wear and tear. Maintenance. It's important to maintain the proper level of compass liquid. Over time, the liquid can evaporate, which can affect the performance of the compass. The compass should be inspected regularly, and the liquid should be topped off as needed. Making of deviation card and recording position of correctors. 1. Deviation card. The deviation card is a vital document used by mariners to correct compass readings for magnetic errors. 2. Recording corrector positions. The positions of the compass correctors, such as the flinders bar, healing magnet, and quadrantal spheres, are carefully documented on the deviation card. 3. Accuracy and precision. Accurate recording of corrector positions ensures the deviation card is a reliable tool for correcting compass readings. 4. Reference point. The deviation card typically includes a reference point, often the ship's compass, for easy identification of the correctors. 5. Maintenance and updates. The deviation card is maintained and updated regularly to account for any changes in the ship's magnetic signature or magnetic field variations. Course Curriculum Introduction Including Legal Aspects and Requirements Principle of Compass Adjustment with Earth's Magnetic Field Ship's Magnetism as a Signature of its Particular Shape Obtaining Magnetic Variation of a Place Magnetic Effects of Electrical Currents Effects of Permanent and Induced Magnetism Hard Iron and Soft Iron Characteristics Compass Design General Principles Compass Compensations Magnetic Effects of Northern and Southern Hemisphere on Healing Correctors Use of Gauss Meter in Adjusting Healing Magnets Coefficients of B, C, D and E Various Types of Transmitting Magnetic Compass Bowls and Repeaters Safe Distances of Navigational and Other Equipment from Compass Identifying Residual Magnetism in Correctors Carrying Out Repairs of Magnetic Compass Compass Liquid Composition and Its Characteristics Removing Bubble from Compass Bowl Practical Session on Compass Adjustment 
making of deviation card and recording position of correctors. About us, Elite Offshore Private Limited, established in 2015, is a leading provider of offshore, marine and industrial safety and skill training and certification programs. With a commitment to safety, compliance, and excellence, we empower professionals worldwide with the knowledge and skills they need for success in their careers. Academy was established in 2021, serves as our specialized division, providing customized e-learning solutions designed to meet the specific needs of the industry. Through Academy, we offer the IADC accredited RigPass online course alongside other valuable e-learning programs like IMDG code courses, basic first aid, and more. Contact us for more information. You can call us, email us, or go through our website and visit us at this address.